Hello everyone, I'm Olaomi Heavens, event veteran, media entrepreneur, and prophetic watchman. I must say that indeed this is a season where we shouldn't entertain fear, but instead as watchmen and intercessors, stand our ground and also put our ears to the post of the Father to hear what he will be saying, especially in terms of strategy and what ought to be done. I think it's a season for us to keep declaring over this nation, Nigeria. We've had so many of the news going amok and what we've been hearing. In fact, last week, 21st, between 21st and 22nd of July 2022, I had a vision where I saw light on a field, just a spot of light. I went there to check on it and then it was almost like I went through a portal. I found myself underground and in this underground place, almost like a switch system, I saw carnivorous rats. In fact, I just saw rats. I didn't know they were carnivorous, but I heard carnivorous rats. And right then and there, I thought to myself, oh my God, if they come out, they're going to overrun everything in their way. And so I found myself leaving that place. I, I don't know if it was an angel, but I saw that he wasn't walking on the ground, but almost just gliding through. And I was following. I went into the place of power. Um, it looked like maybe it was the presidency, but like an authority or like a villa kind of thing. And then I saw that we were looking for strategies. A map was shown to me, but not like the map of Nigeria as a whole, but like the map where you see the tributaries, see the forest streets and things like that. And I saw where the red dots were. But of course, in real life, I cannot read the map. So I guess that was why I couldn't understand either what those dots and those areas looked like. But instantly, I saw that I was in half um, half dressed as a military officer. My bottom had military uniform with the boots, but the top had a black t-shirt. But I had seen that black t-shirt before in a vision where I had black on black and we were holding weapons as women, you know, warriors in a particular vision, which I will not share right now. And then we went into that place and we were looking for strategy. While people were going around to look for strategy, I realized that I opened the Bible and it was like an aha moment where I found out that, wow, the strategy is right here. I do believe that God is giving us strategy in terms of the word and declaration. The scripture in Kings tells us how an angel went into the camp of the enemy and smote them. So I believe that it's not a season to propagate fear. Yes, things are happening around us. But if you are a watchman, if you are a gatekeeper, if you are of the kingdom of God, it's time for you to take a stand in the spirit and start to declare over Nigeria. Prayer does work. There is a new Nigeria in the heart of God and things are shifting. But that does not mean that the enemy will roll over and die. They are still going to try. When, when in scripture... God told Moses to go to Egypt and ensure that the Israelites were released. Pharaoh did not just roll over. Pharaoh made advances. In fact, for every plague that came, he came on stronger until the last plague came. So I believe that as we are taking our stand in this season, we ought also to ensure that we are asking for strategy. It's a season for us to come together. And one of even the strategy that the Lord shared with me during the month of June or July, I can't remember right now, was also unity. I believe that as we come together in unity, we are not seeing barriers or we are not seeing denominations as we pray for the nation Nigeria. We will see our answers come speedily. Thank you so much. Have a blessed, blessed day. Amen.